In this webcast, we're going to go over some of the common organic acids and bases that you'll see in reactions so we can give you an idea of some things to expect. Oftentimes, acids and bases are great catalysts to get reactions to occur. Some typical acids that you'll see that you may have come across before are some strong inorganic acids like an HCl or an H2SO4 or an HNO3. These are three strong acids. Some organic acids that could be added are a P-toluene sulfonic acid, so if you see a TSOH or a PTSA, a TFOH, triflic acid, acetic acid, another one you may see sometimes. Some bases that get added, there are some weak nitrogen-based bases, some pyridine or a triethylamine, some oxygen bases, some sodium hydroxide, sodium ethoxide, sodium ethoxide, or potassium tert-butoxide, some strong nitrogen bases, some sodium amide or lithium disopropyl amide, LDA, sodium hydride, or n-butyl lithium. There are, these are very reactive bases.